Hey Cougars, on behalf of the Acres and Animals Club, we would like to inform you about our club run by Miss Newburn. Our meetings are every other Friday in front of Miss Newburn's room. In the quad on the silver tables, these meetings do not inference with student council. In the Acres and Animals Club, we hope to make a difference in saving animals on our planet by doing challenges and raising money to buy acres of land and our save animal ha habitats. We hope to see you there. Okay. If you have any questions, email Miss Newburn. Thank, Thank you. you. Cougars, let's talk some trash. We all need to pick up, we all need to do our part in picking up and keeping our campus cleaner. Cleaner. All we need to do is pick up after ourselves. It's not that hard, you guys. Recycle and compost and pick up trash if you see it. Staff is only going to be out with Cougar coupons to reward students with keeping things clean. Hey, Davi, do you ride the bus? Yes. Do you wear a mask on the bus or did you know you have to? No, I didn't. Cougars. You must wear a mask to get on the bus. Don't forget your mask if you're planning to ride the bus. Hey, Hulk Cougars. It's Nick, and I'm here to inform you that this Friday, it's going to be beach day. You can wear neon socks, tutus, shirts, etc. And make sure you wear a Hawaiian shirt to show your cougar spirit. We will be gathering at lunch to take pictures of you and your friends who have dressed up. Prizes will be awarded to the Cougars with the best group outfit overall and the best solo outfit for each grade. Have fun and show your spirit, Cougars. Hey, all Cougars. It's Nick, back with your March Madness update. What a wild weekend of games, Cougars. Pure chaos as so many number one seeds went down. Good Gonzaga falling apart cost many people a chance of winning the bracket challenge. So uh, for everybody who picked them, well, oops. Good thing I didn't pick them. Uh, a few shockers and upsets later, and now the dust has settles. Rest in peace to St. Peter's. <laughs> who had one of the most exciting tourney runs of all time heading into the final four of March Madness bracket. Dylan McDonald, a.k.a. DM is in first place with Duke winning it all, but Drew Weinberg in second place with Kansas winning. Then the matchups of the for the final four, four are Kansas versus Villanova, and bitter rivals UNC and the Duke Blue Devils. <clears throat> there are also a few others that are currently a ways off, but with specific results could actually finish at the top. Aiden Byrne, brother of the best basketball player at home and David Katz hanging in there, as well as Reese Mori Prank, who picked Kansas. And still, Mr. Vall also had such a poor bracket, like myself, and he will furthermore be banned from ever being a bracket here at Hall. Good thing I'm an eighth grader, or I would also be banned for how poor my bracket was. Good luck, everybody. Today, in history, March 30th. On March 30th, 1981, President Ronald Reagan was shot and seriously injured outside a Washington, D.C. hotel by John W. Hinckley, Jr. Nobody knows.